Good morning. Wakey, wakey. Up and at them. Rise and shine. Excuse me, my nose itches. Monday morning cup of coffee time. I'm Tommy, your host, and I have this cup in honor of Lisa Oliver Gray. Happy birthday, Lisa. How the flying scramble hooey did you get to be 50? By golly, you're 50 today. I shouldn't say that. You're a lady, but the cat's out of the bag. Embrace it. Embrace your age. I have. I'm comfortable with my 50-ness, as you should as well. Happy birthday, Lisa. Let's have a sip. <sighs> Going to do a gig with Lisa tonight at the High Watt here in Nashville. It's Lisa's birthday gig. It's going to be down at the High Watt, uh, which is on Cannery Row off 8th Avenue South. If you know where the Mercy Lounge is, the High Watt is in the same building. Uh, tonight, me, Lisa Oliver Gray, Will Kimbrough, with a backing band including Brad Pemberton and Mike Vargo and I think Seth Timms, maybe Seth is going to be there. Uh, we're going to have a good time and Lisa is also hosting 8 Off 8, which is a Monday thing with uh, eight different local uh, up and coming acts. By the way, if you hear something noisy in the background, that's the washing machine. Beth started some laundry before she left the house. Uh, she's the only one who knows how to start the washing machine. I don't, I don't know how it works. I have asked in the past, do you need help with the laundry? And I have asked her several times, would you show me how to work the washing machine? And she has always dodged the issue. I think she doesn't want me to do the laundry because I'll put a red shirt in with a white towel and we'll wind up having pink towels or something like that. I don't know why. She's possessive over it. And anyway, enough about laundry. Get back on topic, Tommy. Okay, so tonight, come wish Lisa Oliver Gray a happy birthday at the High Watt, or go to her Facebook page right now and say, Happy Birthday, Lisa. Uh, uh, what's going on the rest of the week? Uh, Friday, this coming Friday, the 15th at the Family Wash, I'll be performing uh, as one of the guest lead vocalists uh, with the Sons of Zevon. They're uh, a band here in town that does uh, classic music staples of a specific year. It's 1978 night at the Wash this Friday with the Sons of Zevon. And during the uh, acoustic opening set, I'm going to do I Was Only Joking by Rod Stewart. Probably my favorite Rod Stewart song. And in the second set, the electric set, I'm doing Far Away Eyes by the Stones with the band. And I don't even have to rehearse that one. That, that song is part of my DNA. I was driving home early Sunday morning through Bakersfield. Saturday the 16th, the Evening Muse in Charlotte, North Carolina, opening for Ellis Paul. I hope and pray that if you are anywhere in the Charlotte, North Carolina area, you will come and see me play. That's the Evening Muse, Saturday, November 16th, opening up for Ellis Paul. And then next week, it uh, it heats up even more. Wednesday, November 20th at the basement. Daddy, full band gig. All five original members of Daddy. Me, Will Kimbrough, John Dedrick, Paul Griffith, and Dave Jakes. Wednesday, November 20th, which happens to be my 51st birthday. That's what I wanted for my birthday was a daddy show. So I'm getting a daddy show. Thursday, November 21st, the Off-Broadway in St. Louis, Missouri. Friday, November 22nd, Knuckleheads in Kansas City. Sunday, uh, November 24th, uh, Omaha, Nebraska with the Sunday Roadhouse Concert Series. I don't remember the name of the venue. I'll tell you next week. And that's what's going on in the next couple of weeks. Uh, uh, later on in November, near the end of the month, uh, Tommy Gunn, my Clash cover band, has a gig at the basement. And Bill Lloyd and I will be performing with a backup band, including Keith Brogdon and Mike Vargo, at the Warehouse at Mount Victor in Bowling Green, Kentucky. That'll be at the end of November. And that's it for right now. I hope you have a delightful Monday. I hope you have a scintillating Monday. I hope you have a cool Monday. And I hope you like my new glasses. You can't really tell, but they're blue on the inside. Uh, I think they make me look smart and intelligent and literate and stuff. Anyway, don't let the bastards get you down. Have a good day. God bless you. 
You deserve it. I'll see you next week. Oh, I forgot. The coffee today we're drinking is from the Turtle Creek Coffee Company uh, in Columbia, South Carolina. They sent me some free coffee, and this is from the Bourbon Collection, right there, Daterra. And uh, it's a combination of fruit of the red and yellow bourbon trees. And uh, I wish I had had a bourbon tree uh, back when I was drinking. Uh, I would love to, to have tapped a bourbon tree like you would tap a maple tree. And, and uh, instead of getting sap out, I would get Maker's Mark. That would have, it would have been great fun to have had a bourbon tree in the front yard. Uh, I would have passed out underneath its branches on many occasions. Anyway, that's it for the cup of coffee. God bless you. Don't let the bastards get you down. Still, have a good one. Rock on. Take it easy. Don't you go a-changing. See ya. For real, it's over this time. This is no drill. I'm serious. <laughs>